Show. Soldiers of Asgard. We are back in Skyrim. Alright, I'm just gonna kill these guys real quick. And that's the blue. Okay. I'll deal with that stuff later. I don't know who's saying all that treasure. I looked around. Looks like those reekling things over there. I just want to learn how to make a Thalrim. I mean, I think it would be cool if you could make heavy and light armor Thalrim, and it's actually like the best armor now. Because it's like the best armor in the game is some is you have to straight up craft it. Because like there's other ar armors that are better, or they have like really good enchants. But it's like you can always enchant it for better. Like max out enchanting, and then you take what I did, max out smithing and enchanting, as you saw. And I took the potions. There's that potions like armor you make or uh, armor you upgrade is 40% stronger or something. I took like 40% blacksmithing one and a 40% uh, enchanting one before I did it all, which is why it's like my sword has 63 extra damage instead of like 50 or whatever. And, it, and I'll never have to recharge any of my stuff. I don't know why. I don't know if that's a glitch or something. But I've never had to recharge any of my weapons, any of my enchanted weapons. I've had them forever. Never had to recharge them. And I don't think I even have, or I don't know, I might have. I don't think I have that, uh, that perk. There's a perk in enchanting that makes it you're so, uh, like recharges on its own. New enchantments, uh, okay, come on. Skill enchantments on armor, no. Uh, stronger, can you put two on champ? Yeah. Death plus the creatures, but not people. Trap 5% of the victim's soul recharge. Yeah, I don't even have that. Souls gems provide extra magic over when you're charging. Frost and channel weapons and armor are 20. Say, I guess I can do these three. And then my weapons will be even stronger. It hey, is good up? to see you again, my friend. Yes, and I brought the map. I know you faced great danger to bring this map to me. There are no words to tell how glad my heart is. You don't have to tell me words, Thank just you, tell me friend. how to craft blacksmith. I name you Friend of the Skull, and I will trust Woo! you with the knowledge of forging Stalrim. Woo! If you bring Stalrim here to my forge, you can use my tools to make what you Woo! will from it. Until our next meeting, Skull Friend. Woohoo! May your hunts always bring you game, and your crops grow tall and gaunt. Yeah, I don't have crops. My okay, my turn. My turn. My turn. Star Rob, Star Rob, Star Rob. Uh, where? Nordic? This is that Nordic crap. Bro, so you're gonna teach me how to crap Star Rob? Let me guess, you need me to do something dangerous. Quite right. Quite right. This, however, is. Allow me to explain, a yes. Of history, oh, I'm so sad to be most intriguing, blah blah blah. I've come to know those ruins so well, I could draw, you, could draw you a map, map. that's why I know it's a new patch at the moment. Right. New passes to an what? Old tomb, I think. It must have been opened by an. I'd love okay. to have a closer look. I'll be heading back there soon. If you're interested, meet okay, me. Okay, cool. It's, this is not even its forge. Isn't this forge over here? This is this is a meat. This is a meat place. Did I get a book? Did I get a book that teaches me stuff? It's tradition. Oh wait. Do I have to give him the star room? Is that what he said? Homemaker Will and Young Nicola. Fear to think what would have happened. Tell me about forging. You need to obtain some stall room, of course, and then you'll need to work it. How do I forge into skill and patience? <clears throat> I'd say if you know how to forge ebony, then you know everything you need to know in order to forge stall room. That is such garbage. Swear to God. 
Ebony is over here. I can't. No, that's not. That's dangerous. Oh no. Wait, where's Ebony? Dwarven, Orcish, Ebony. I gotta put three skills in here. Just to, and that's, and it's the same as Ebony. So it's just as strong as Ebony, but not even stronger than. Okay, I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna save it, put the skills in there, and see how the armor is. If it's good, I'll keep it. If it's not, I'm gonna load up this save. And we'll be very disappointed in all of the Skyrim people. Like, oh, then why don't you use your perks? That's why I didn't want to gain three levels just to use this. Okay. I now know all this stuff I will never use. Alright, it's Starrim! The weapons of the skull will never be dull. Um, door iron chamber tends the forge. Oh, there is light armor. Okay, cool. Ooh, that looks cool. Okay. Sauron Light Armor, 77. What does Dragon start out at? It's heavy armor. 81. Uh, it's not looking good. 34. It's heavy. That's 34. That's also 34. 24, 24. 24, 24. <coughs> um, Sauron Bow is 43. Great Sword is 75. Less and less. So the weapons are better, and the armor is either the same or a little worse. The, the chest piece is better, but the other stuff is about the same. I'm sorry guys. I think you might have been looking forward to some stall room, but it's not worth three perks just to craft stall room that I'm not gonna really use. I mean I guess I can change my armor up, but it's like this is right here, this is Odin. This is Odin right here. If I change the armor, it's not gonna be Odin anymore. Oh, yeah, your son made a noodle necklace in class? That's awesome. Why don't you just get don't you come back and start talking to me? So I'm probably not going to use them, sorry guys. They should have made it better. It's like you have to know ebony armor making and do this quest. And it makes armor that's not even that good. And I gotta put three mother effing perks. I already have like a full set of dragon, like heavy armor, dragon bone armor. I'll probably have to make a new, new set those. I think those have enchants that are just like health and stamina, just melee attacking things. Which I guess I can still use it. <coughs> like the only spell I use is for healing, and I'm always maxed out in that. My helmet helps with that. Alright. What to do next? So I tried to get the pickaxe thing, that didn't work. Did. I know how to make stall room and that really didn't do anything. I killed that orc and had a good time. I guess I can go to the Valok's tomb. That sounds sounds like a fun thing to do. Let's go to the beast stone. Head over there. Oh, what is that? That looks cute. So I guess I'm just going to sell the stall room I have. And just deposit the pickaxe because I don't even need it. Like I don't even need to mine stall room. It's easy to make though. Like all the stuff, it just took a couple things of stall room. You didn't need anything else. In the land of stall room, I need the other black books too. I was told there's like seven or eight. I got five. Conjure Werebearer added. That is quite awesome. So let me <clears throat> let me know where the other ones because I really don't look anything up. I don't I don't like looking things up. But I have I have that, whatever that word is. The hidden twilight, the winds of change, untold legends, waking dreams. I got five. If there are seven and or eight, 
Uh, let me know where they're at. What's, I mean, you guys told me about there's one in the mines, and I got that. So I don't know if there's other quests. Oh, maybe there's one here. A tomb did open up. Tombs usually have black books, I've, I've noticed. Oh! I thought that was a deep crevice. But it actually it wasn't. Oh. Was I supposed to go in here? Or was the guy outside waiting for me? Oh, my stomach. I partook of too much mead last night. My stomach is not liking it. And I also have an announcement about the Odin show, which I will tell you guys after the loading. Ah, oh, he was outside. Yeah, yeah, shut up. I swear, if the quest change and it's pointed inside, I'm going to be mad. But I have enough time to talk. Okay. So it seems like uh, in February, like near the end of February to early March, I will be getting an HD recorder. My videos will be coming out in HD. There's a pretty good chance this is going to happen. Uh, end of February, early March. HD videos. Um, <clears throat> also, I have the, my intro. That fat beat <laughs> for the intro. Oh my god, it's telling me to go inside now. I had a feeling oh, that tonight was going to be a good night. Anyway, so the guy that laid down that fat beat... Um, he wants to start doing videos. The Runaway O Productions, uh, Raw for short, R A W. He's gonna, he's gonna get his channel ready. And he wants to start making videos, and for his debut, I guess that sounds pretty lame. But for his starting videos, we were gonna do uh, Odin and Raw are gonna take down Dead Space Three. Well, that comes out soon. I haven't played the demo yet. I've seen the demo. I haven't played it yet because I just I kind of don't like playing demos before the actual game, especially because demos usually aren't finished. So there's like glitches and weird things and. Remarkable, isn't it? This tomb has been hidden. Remarkable, isn't it? It looks like a black book. No. Nope. Yes. And a switch below it. There is a switch. Now, I'm not sure if you can read the dragon language, but this seems to be a riddle of some sort. A sacrifice will bring you closer to that which you seek. I wonder what it means. I'm probably going to have to kill you. But yeah, we're going to do uh, <coughs> Death Space 3 together. There seem to be some and we're going to record. About on the floor I'm just going to... Oh. You can drop someone in there. Oh uh, yeah, I'm gonna sacrifice this meat to the fire. But yeah, I was gonna record uh, my screen. We're gonna play co-op, and he's gonna record his screen and uh, like record his stuff, and he was gonna upload. That turned out. Why are you coming with me? I thought you gotta like wait outside. Um, but yeah, like he's gonna record. Oh my god. He was gonna record his screen. I was gonna record mine. Upload on mine. He was gonna upload his on his. Uh, so you get like both point of views. But we're gonna be like recording the, like the audio together. So you'll have my sexy voice and his sexy voice. Just to see how it goes, and then he's gonna do his own thing. I mean, we might come together and do more if you guys enjoyed it, enjoyed our chemistry. But yeah, that's just down the road. But that's that's gonna happen. So look forward uh, to Dead Space Three stuff. I like scary games, and I've played a lot of them. But there's really not that many games out there that are actually like scary. So Dead Space One and Two are pretty scary. Hopefully the Three, they kept it scary. They didn't go into like combat mode. But so I was looking at the demo, and it looked like there was a lot of combat. So hopefully they don't switch it to just straight like combat, barely any scares, it's just killing a bunch of monsters. I mean you can make your own weapons and stuff, that's pretty cool. Oh. Along with the puzzle. Can 
Continue along the path. Don't tread where you've been. That was easy. Shout, shout, let it all out. These are the things, something, something about. Come on. I'm gonna talk. What the hell just happened? Old Man River, get behind me! You have a special name? Nope, you're just a Death Lord. I'm the Death Lord. Mother, ah! You're dead. Don't even shout me, bro. Use that shield, bro. Use that shield. Use that shield. Oh, never mind. You ain't got no head now. Let's have a closer look. Let's have a closer look. I already got the shout, bro. I already got that shout, bro. Amethyst Claw, right half. Okay. There's the left half in here. First to a guardian, and inspire What is, uh, what? What is this shout I have learned? Your thorm enchants your nearby allies' weapons, allowing them to attack faster. Oh my god, it's like the same one I have, but it sucks. I like the same... Oh, there's this one. Allowing for faster weapon strikes, which I would use all the time, but it's like your weapon cannot be enchanted while you use it. Guardian was it has to be unenchanted, which is like a red dragon. It looks like a secret entrance opened up along the wall. You lead the way. Secret entrance opened up along the wall. What? I lead the way. What secret entrance? A what? A secret entrance. Oh, there we go. But yeah, like I was saying, I like scary games. I kind of get scared easily. I've been scared a few times in Skyrim. Like, I'll turn around, there'll be someone there, I'll be like, oh my god! I think a couple videos ago, I got scared with one of those, like, jellyfish things. Just, like, appeared right next to my nuts, and I got scared. But yeah, I think it'll be fun. And he's, he's a wimp. A wimp just like me, so we'll both get scared and you guys can laugh at us. It'll be just fun for the whole family. But yeah, so HD videos plus a co-op video that might be quite hilarious. All that can be yours and more. If the price is right. Is this still following me? Oh my, oh there he is, okay. I really don't even care. I think there's gonna be enemies in here. I can't see myself. Thanks for the blast of fresh air, guys. Really cools me up after a long day of fighting. Oh, nice dodge. But can you dodge this? Heavy armor, yes. Bow. Why are you still alive? Oh, you just shouted your friend out of this world. You missed! You dumb goofed! That was a chick. That was quite unattractive. A little too much skin and bone, if you ask me. Sit back down! It's past your bedtime. Anyone else? Anyone else want to go night night? Oh, what is that? Oh! Thank God I brought the blade. Oh no, that's a staff of flames. Something. See what the inscription says. Nordic arrow. All men must die, often by their own means. Sounds rather grim, if you ask me. The inscription must be a reference to these pillars. Three pillars, including a central one. Perhaps they're connected somehow. Ah, that's the trick. 
Oh, okay. Don't attack me, bro. So, that one I hit it with a sword and it glow, glowed red. This one I got to hit with a staff and it'll glow that color. It'll glow blue, or it should at least. Yep. And that one needs to be shot with an arrow. Uh, hopefully a crossbow will do. It did do. There you go. Now, see what mysteries await us in the next room. Another shout just for me? Wake up, man. Wake up. There you are. Get out of bed! It's time for school! Oh, the old is slapping everybody with a saw out. I got the left half. Have the arrow, yeah. Find the main burial chamber. Oh, I will. I will find the next, or the main burial chamber. In the next video. Catch you guys later. Hey soldiers of Asgard, Odin here. Don't forget to like, favorite, and comment. And if you want a guaranteed spot in Valhalla next to me, don't forget to subscribe. Also, I have a Facebook account at facebook.com slash the Odin Show. Thanks for watching.